What's going on, guys? Thanks for stopping by the channel. It's your main man, Joey Sparks. That's two E's, no Y. You heard me. That's two E's, no Y. And today, I'm going to give my biggest tip on how to achieve that cinematic look in your videos. Let's go. I'm going to do like everyone else, and I'm going to ask you to consider hitting that subscribe button, a like on the video, and, you know, the notification bell. But I hate how everyone else does it. So instead of asking you to slap that like button, just just like barely brush, just kind of nudge up against that like button. That would help a lot. Just just maybe with your elbow, just kind of just <clears throat> that like button. That's all we're asking for. If you were going to hit that subscribe button, maybe like a flying elbow drop right on that subscribe button. Okay. That's all a slight nudge, a bump to the like button, and then a flying elbow to the subscribe button. Let's get on to the tip. My biggest tip to try and achieve that cinematic look is a special one. Now there's many things involved in trying to achieve that cinematic look. Right camera, lens, focal length, lighting, depth within the shot, and my favorite, the rule of thirds. So when you're talking about the rule of thirds, what you want to do is take the frame that we're in and cut it into nine equal parts. That's two vertical lines and two horizontal lines, right? And then whatever you want your viewer to view, you place on one of those lines. Yeah? So particularly right now, I want you focused right here. So the rule of thirds states that that should run on one of those lines. Now, since I'm kind of centering up, I chose to do the top horizontal line, right? But if I wanted to be in some sort of, I don't know, movie scenario, maybe I want to use one of these. Wherever you want the viewer to see, you should focus on putting them on one of those third lines. Some classic examples. personal favorites. Uh, it's no stranger that um, my favorite director, Quentin Tarantino, uh, my favorite film is Pulp Fiction. I was coming of age at that time. And that's when I got, you know, like my first taste of non-linear film storytelling. And it, it, it blew my socks off. So I always paid attention. And one of his cinematographers, Robert Richardson, phenomenal. I'm going to take an example from Kill Bill, the first one. At the end, when the girls are dueling, check out the rule of thirds on this. Phenomenal. And then I could sit here and tell you more and more, but why don't you take it upon yourself and watch professional video, professional films, movies, television, and they will all stick to that rule of thirds. It's a great way to lead the audience to where you want their eyes to go in your frame. That's it. You start implementing that into your videos that you produce, and you'll see your videos become more cinematic the more and more you implement this tip. Okay, thank you guys for stopping by. Once again, please consider hitting that stripe button. Elbow drop on the subscribe button. And we're going to just ever so gently nestle up against that like button. Thank you. All your support's appreciated. We'll see you next time. Peace.